hi my loves welcome and welcome back to this channel i am olukule to know by name a beauty and lifestyle content creator based in lagos nigeria it's been a minute we had a sit down video that is actually directed at content creation so today in this video we will be talking about content creation and how to make about six figures monthly from content creation from being a content creator so if this sounds like something you are interested in then you need to keep watching this video okay quick disclaimer this video is not for you if you are looking for a quick way to make money as a content creator because i would be showing you step by step things on how to make money up to six figures monthly as a content creator if you do not want to trust the process and enjoy the journey as a content creator i do not think this video is for you let's dive into the video the first point i have is put in the work if you want to make money from content creation you need to put in the work content creation is not just something that you do playfully and you expect to actually make good money of it if it is something you're looking at making good money of you really need to put in the work if you're good money of you need to really really put in the work i wouldn't say there is nothing like luck in the content creation industry anything can happen with your content you just blow up without much work and you're making a lot of money but really the way content creation works is you need to put in the work luck does not shine on every single person and if eventually luck shines on you your videos go viral and all of that you you just have the big numbers and everything if you do not know the nitty-gritty of content creation trust me believe me you <laughs> that's blowing that virality would not be so good for you in the long run so you need to know the nitty-gritty of content creation so that if that blow comes right now if that virality comes right now you would be able to manage it properly so you need to put in the work and how can you put in the work as a content creator you need to upgrade on your skill over time you do not want to remain stagnant you need to keep improving yourself take courses save money to buy gadgets to buy gears and everything that you need to keep on improving your content quality content style content kind every single thing about your content creation journey looking at me now you would be like oh she has everything she's this and that already so what's she just trying to say i would say you should just go back to my old old videos even as as early as five months ago my content quality has really really gone beyond that my content style everything has changed because i keep on improving on my skill i do not just stay in one place and remain stagnant in that place i want to grow when you are hungry for growth you would actually put in the work so if you want to really make money from content creation then you need to put in the work you need to put in the work stay consistent i know consistency is hard and you've heard it over and over again consistency can be quite hard and it can also be quite simple when you hack the consistency thing it is really really beautiful but you just need to learn how to be consistent it's going to really really help you because when you put in the work People can see the changes in your content style, your content quality and everything. People can see that you are really, really trying your best to improve yourself, to improve your content and everything. Not just people are seeing this. Brands can also see these things. And the thing about content creation is, or the thing about life is, you don't know who is watching. People are actually watching and you do not know who is watching. You have no idea who is watching. So keep doing your thing, keep improving on yourself putting the work to get better and better and better daily we keep learning on a daily basis once we stop learning then we are dead so you want to keep learning and learning and learning to improve yourself to improve everything about you as relating content creation and your life okay so first one is put in the work again say that put in the work that would be it for the first point the second point would be charge your worth without feeling 
guilty now i used to be at that point whereby i would give a brand my weight and i'm like mm, this is not too much you know ah think about it the brand is this the brand is. i know we can make compromise sometimes and all of that but my dear charge what you want to charge without feeling guilty you might be feeling guilty in the sense that you feel like it's, your, it's just your social media page you were just posting yourself and you got that audience like why should you then be making money like that off your platform and you feel like your um, brands are paying you they're covering delivery they they're, they're paying you to create content and you're also keeping this product you feel like you're cheating these brands but that is not it that is not true because that is how content creation works without that product you would not be able to create the content for the brand so you actually need the product in your disposition to be able to create the content so i feel like you should understand where i am going to you need to stop feeling guilty about why content creation is actually like this that is just it so you cannot create content without the product except you want to lie about the product products that you're not even seeing how would you share the product in the video and everything so these things has to be sent to you they have to get across to you for you to be able to work so you are not cheating anybody you need to stop feeling guilty about charging your worth because you actually like worth it it is what you are meant to be paid and about charging your worth you just need to know what you want to earn as a person look at the value you're offering look at the work that goes into creating this content look at the work that you're actually putting to creating this content and everything that would like give you an idea of what you should charge these brands when they come to you to create content for them or whichever service you're offering in line with content creation this would give you an idea on what to charge this brand okay so you need to stop stop feeling guilty about what you charge because i know guilt can come in different angles i just say that as an example and i hope that you would stop feeling guilty about it because that is really how content creation works next point which is the third one is something i actually love personally it is offer value you want to offer value to every client every brand that you get i understand some brands can be problematic and all of that you agree on something and at the end they're like no this is not what we want we want you to do like this and you ask them for a brief they're like just do you and everything or probably they didn't they did not tell you they want something as a detail in this video like this thing we want you to show it in this video and you make the video you skip that like you personally think oh this is just the perfect kind of video for this brand and they're like no we want this and that and that and that i know some brands can be really really problematic i just hope you do not come across those kind of brands but even though regardless of what still treat every brand with care love respect or no because they're giving you money they're putting food on your table although you're giving them value also like it's just an exchange you're giving them value they need to pay for the value you're giving them they cannot get that value you're giving them somewhere else but then again they are putting food on your table okay if they do not come definitely another brand would come of course but then you need to treat every single brand with respect you need to give every brand value so i like to like end every of my deals with brands on a very good note because you do not know who know who knows somebody who knows somebody that would come and give you a very very high paying job i i am a testament of this most of the jobs i get are based on referrals and they are very very important for service providers so this is not just about content creation if you offer service products and everything ensure that you are giving value it would really really help you go a long way so give your clients value let them know that ah, this girl busted my brain bust actually you like this girl wait you now like just make them feel happy make them feel excited about your partnership i promise you you would get angry sometimes like you don't want to do it again but because of relationship and mind you because you want to keep relationship you want to offer value you want to respect this brand 
that does not mean you should take on on some silly jobs i'm not saying that watch what you take on okay so you need to just like respect these brands and everything because these brands they know themselves they know one another and anything can happen a brand can just give you a free shout out and boom you're getting clients we want you to work with us this brand vouched for you and all of that because these brand owners they trust themselves actually when your name is mentioned from so, so, so person they want to work with you because that person mentioned your name so ensure that you treat every brand with respect offer them value and do not treat them just anyhow and just will them create your content take your content and give me my money it shouldn't be that way also it is not just about you getting referrals and everything it is for your personal self good name is better than good money good name is better than good money you need to like keep your name you need to keep your integrity ah you want people to keep respecting your brand because your content creation business your content creation career is not about you it is your brand because your content creation is not just you it is actually your brand so you want people to keep respecting your brand and always want to come back for more so ensure try as much as possible to offer value to these brands because it is very very important yeah so that is all for the third point the so next one which is the fourth point would be put yourself out there put yourself out there i know you some people i know some people struggle with putting themselves out there they're like i don't know how to do these things it's simple just keep uploading your work if you're scared of pitching to brands i would advise that you take away that fear the worst thing you can get from these brands is a no what if they do not send you a no and they told you a yes so think about it think about it that the worst thing that can happen is you getting a no you need to put yourself out there talk to people about the services you offer stay consistent put your face in people's face like let them always remember oh this person once i need a service like this no it's this person i'm calling on so put yourself out there let people know you do not be shy your friends might be like oh why are you wasting your time on and all of that keep doing it keep doing it i remember then they will tell me you're just mixing stuff on your hair you're wasting your time on your hair and all of that mind you why now my hair made the way for me in this content creation career so don't care don't care about what people say because hmm, if you care about what people say you would be losing out in this life okay so if you do not want to lose out in life do not care about what people say about the path that you have chosen as long as it doesn't hurt anyone and it is what you you actually want to do keep doing it okay so you need to put yourself out there i am begging you i am begging you make it a challenge and at the end of it you're like okay if i pitch to five brands this week i'm going to give to myself something make it a challenge write your goals down and everything it would really help you to be able to put yourself out there and overcome fear and you not being confident and everything it would really help you you need to build your confidence you need to build your confidence and take away that fear asap so pitch yourself to brands pitch yourself to people tell people about your service talk to the camera if you need to talk to the camera just put yourself out there just choke them choke people with what you do people will talk people would never ever stop talking so keep doing your thing because they will never stop talking i hope with this you have been convinced to put yourself out there without thinking about whatever anybody would say next point would be offer varieties of services or no con or water one way to not enter the market as a content creator you are able to offer different services you can sell digital products you can train people on how to create videos how to edit pictures you can just teach a lot of things and you can create videos for brands sponsored creation user-generated creation product videography 
product photography, whichever one you are good at. And do not stay at just what you are good at. I would advise you keep improving your skill. That was the first point I said that put in the work improve your skills learn new skills in line with content creation it would really really help you i've had a situation where a brand um hired me for a particular job i got the job and because they saw i could do this they actually gave me the job to do that also instead of taking that money to another person i got the money for two different jobs so it would really help you as a content creator because you can be offering two different services to one particular brand or about three services to a particular brand and it's not choking you because you can actually like differentiate these services properly you let the brand know your terms and condition and everything you can also work from the comfort of your home if you are lucky to get a fully remote role so just keep doing it offer many services do not offer just one service because a lot of things are there to content creation there are different a lot of aspects to content creation try as much as possible to at least be able to do about three different things in line with content creation it would really help you to make more money as a content creator because some brands they want this particular service they don't want videography for that month they don't want ugc for that month they just want product pictures for that month they reach out to you um they see you make videos and all of that can you do product photography and like no i cannot oh they'll take your money somewhere else but if you could do product photography you would be getting that money try as much as possible to offer more than one service it's going to really really help you to make more money as a content creator the sixth point i have for you is this have packages you want your rate card to come in packages do not just give one video is five thousand naira. no you want to ensure that you are having packages so that you know that with every deal you're getting you are making a minimum of this amount so you know that okay in this deal like the least amount of money i'm making on one deal would be fifty thousand naira. you want to really split that fifty thousand naira in a package that is actually giving value to the brand instead of you giving a rate that has five thousand naira for one video you can give a rate that has fifty thousand naira for 11 videos this would be left to the brand to let you know if they want up to 11 videos or just five videos you can actually let them know that okay my rate is like this because of this and that and that packages actually work for content creators before i didn't know about having packages or having the right packages i see that it wasn't working for me until when i got it right and i was able to know that okay this is what i want to do and that has been working for me so on every deal i know that this is the minimum of money that i am getting on every deal it would really help you and before this can actually work you need to have really put in the work let them see that okay this person is worth it the our content the value of our content the quality of our content is actually worth a package and ensure that your branding is on point because these are things that these brands look at before they actually like agree to your rates they want to see your branding they want to see your content quality how good are you with content creation that is why i mentioned the above points before this one you need to put in the work improve your skills properly keep just be better just keep improving your skills because that is really the first point to actually making more money if you are not so good trust me brands would not want to come to you so that might be one reason you are not getting these deals as you wish to get so just put in the work and everything so back to the package you need to have packages for your rate card it's going to really really help you like just have packages bonus tip is do not be too quick to send your rate card some brands have a higher budget than what you would normally charge for that particular service some brands are very straightforward with what they want they'll tell you we want 10 videos we want five pictures and everything what is your rate for this you say okay i would like to know your budget if it is what i can work with if you see that their budget is higher than what you would actually normally charge you can actually just say okay i would be able to do this for you you shouldn't allow the response to actually show that their budget is higher than yours you should like you know play smart okay play smart with your response and if the budget is way way lower than what you would normally charge then you need to tell them you can actually tell them that their 
deliverables doesn't align with their budget and this is what you charge and blah 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 and you just like just make sure your response is smart and professional enough for this brand and respectful okay do not sound insultive to brands or belittling to brands in your response no matter what okay i hope this video has been an eye opener on how you can make more money as a content creator let me know which of this point you really resonate with which of this point you would be practicing more and if you have some other points that you wish to share with us in the comment section please do share with us because everybody including me is open to learning okay so i hope you enjoyed this video and remember to share this video with somebody that you think struggles with making money as a content creator also do get subscribed you cannot get this information for free of course although it's actually free but please support by getting subscribed and like this video drop a comment as well and check my other videos i will see you in my next video bye